sawatarix.com. The new homepage is up. Hatashi homepage ga kansei shimashita. It's the place where you can submit your personal MTG alteration requests. You can also check out my art. I usually do acrylic paintings and art gallery. I stream magic about like two, three times per week. And if you want me to play your deck on my stream, then uh, let's fucking go. And have I even mentioned that I do coaching too? Well, there's like so much more to it. So please check out my home brand new homepage, swatarix.com. Thank you so much, boy. Hey yo, what's up everyone? It's your boy Kai Sawatari, aka Sawatarix Magic Online. What is up everyone? Misan konbaan wa Sawatari Kai, aka Sawatarix Magic Online desu. Dei wake de ne, chotto... Koitemasu ka ne? Can you guys hear me properly? Sounds good, sounds good. I think, I think it sounds good. Alright, okay. So, you know, I make it quick and easy. Um, today, we have a special mission, okay? So like, We've played so much Legacy Doomsday in like the past year or so that, um, well, you know, a lot of people said that it's a little like Fast Oracle made it a little too easy, okay? Well, that's on you because I think we can probably challenge you guys by like telling you that Fast Oracle might not be. I mean, it's actually the, 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 the biggest reason why Doomsday actually is a tier 1 deck, but today we're gonna try something else and, um, I'm gonna find out if Doomsday still remains tier 1 if there's no fish in the 75, okay? I'm talking 75, so not, not even in the, in the sideboard, okay? No Thassus Oracle whatsoever. Yeah, it's 10pm on this beautiful Thursday evening in Tokyo. Uh, it's also somewhat warm, like warm for january right? it's like five degrees celsius it's not too bad <laughs> okay okay uh, no, the doomsday is not like it's not like doomsday it's not like 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 なんか簡単すぎでもあるっていうコメント結構いただいててそれチャイロンみたいななのでいやそれチャイロンみたいなのでいやそれチャイロンみたいなのでいやそれチャイロンみたいなのでいやそれチャイロンみたいなのでいや
I meant the one blue 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 jace with ma manic effects stapled on it. Shit, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. Is that? Did I? Did we? Did we all skip this card? When did that card came out? <laughs> Wait. A, a four mana jace, the maniac effect placed on it. Holy shit, jace, wielder of mystery. I gotta, I gotta look up that card. I, I don't even know what you guys are talking about. When did that came out? Like. 10 years ago, or what? Let me... <laughs> Scryfall, thank you... War of the Spark? Yeah, well, no wonder, because War of the Spark had like so many ridiculously powerful planeswalkers and like no one was talking about... Holy shit, this is a- oh wow, it's a rare. 4 mana, 4 loyalty, if you if you would draw a card while your library has no cards in it, you win the game instead. Okay, so that's literally lab Laboratory Maniac, okay, well I get it, and then a plus 1 target player puts the top 2 cards of the library into the graveyard, draw a card, ooh wow, now draw a card, okay. So you play him and you and then you plus and then you win, right? And then minus 8 is <laughs> draw 7 cards. Then if your library has no cards in it, you win the game. Wait, isn't that exactly what the emblem already says? Then if the library has no cards and you win the game, what? Will you win twice? Am I stupid? What? What? Hey, Dr. Janitor, how is it going, buddy? How's it going? Thank you so much for tuning in. I played that Jason Vintage for a bit. It wasn't bad. Dude, this card looks awful. Dude, this is a freaking four mana triple blue simple like we have to resolve Doomsday, that's like a triple black mana card. And now you're telling me that like resolving a triple blue mana planeswalker is not, is not a big deal? Holy shit. In what world are we living? You can win with exactly 7 cards library with ulti. Ah, gotcha. Okay, so you don't have to draw the 8th card. Okay, well, cool. Okay, that's like the little like, cherry on top. I get it. Okay, we played a bit in Frenzy builds. Yikes. Okay, well, you know, that's at least the mission for today. <laughs> I can't think, you know, um, we're gonna run through a whole league, a constructive league of this, and see how we do. Honestly, I was, I was not really ready for this at all. I just, you know, I just made a random tweet, right? And, and then, uh, you know, this happened. So uh, let's, um, let's jump right into the... Workstation here. So we got this is this is the, this is my absolute go-to Doomsday decklist. Haven't changed a single card. This is the like this is the card. Uh, this is the decklist you find on my Discord. Um, at the, with the uh, sideboarding guide for my subscribers. By the way, if you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. You know, just hit it. Hit me, baby. Um, but again, like this deck has not changed at all. This is the stock Saltarix Deluxe experience deck uh however you want to call it but there is obviously the sus oracle so that girl is gonna come out okay boom okay done so no thoughts oracle in the deck anymore there's no there's no fish in the sideboard now the question is how do we want to win right because we have to play doomsday still in the main deck so we have to be a doomsday deck but I still need a win condition. I currently don't have a win condition. So the question is, what is our win condition? <laughs> I have a couple. I have a couple of ideas. Okay, so we could make it super simple and run Laboratory Maniac. Another idea is to run Embercool, Sherlock Isle, and I have to add Fer. No, what was it called? Cloud of Fairies <laughs> in the main deck. And this is our only win condition. Emrakul is our only win condition. We can do that. Or we can also play Emrakul, Sherlock Isle, Cloud Fairies, and Laboratory Maniac in the main deck. Or we could play this weird Jace, Wielder of Mysteries, and Emrakul, and Slapman. All of them. <laughs> <laughs> tendrils of course how the hell am i supposed to tendrils people for storm 10 with this deck like that's that's not even possible what, what are you talking about I, I can like storm storm one so i can drain you for four life 
<laughs> minus Oracle, minus Kevin, plus Tendrils, plus Echo, easy peasy. Holy shit. I don't know how many reps you guys have in Storm, but that's not how Storm works. <laughs> Holy shit. Like, am I supposed to, like, put to what? Like, put Tendrils on top if personal tutor and then, like, go Dark Witch for Tendrils to you? Could we do the old type of Doomsday with Sherlock, Emrakul, and Solidarity? Holy shit, how does that work? Solidarity. How does... That's that's the white enchantment, isn't it? How does that work? Did I gotta look at the one up? That's the one where you draw where you stop drawing cards, right? No, wait. Solidarity. The creative tendrils was playing in Doomsday before, dude. Yeah, well, but not in this shell, I think. Right? Solid. Like, didn't people go like uh, full? Four lines of diamonds and like, like wasn't like literally a storm deck Doomsday or like DDFT. Solidarity, four mana creatures to control get plus O plus five until end of turn. No, wait, that's not the card you. Wait, what? This is not the card you you mentioned, right? So you wanna make Emrakula fifteen twenty? Uh, I posted a PTT pile with exact exacties in, in the mean deck channel yesterday. Shit, I only required a brainstorm in hand and two randoms. This like a storm deck with four LEDs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, 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 I might have seen it in the past. It had like Sensei's tops and like Dark Rituals, a couple of like maybe like even Rider of Flames. Burning Witch was definitely in the deck. And then you had like. Man, you had like all sorts of like weirdo cards in the sideboard, right? Like wasn't there like a time spiral too? Like a draw seven was the sideboard, so you can burning wish for it. Um a tendrils of agony, uh, empty the warns. It was it was wild, it was wild. So dirty is a variation of high tide. Ooh, that's oh wait, yeah, that's a so we're not talking about this stupid instant from eighth edition for mana. <laughs> <laughs> also, Jack Battle, thank you so much for tuning in. Hey, good to have you here. How's it going, buddy? How is it going? Holy shit. You know what? So, it is it's only the name of a deck, not the card. Yeah, it's that's that's our sh scratch. This how was something like Echo, LED, Dark Ritual, Lotus Pedal, Dance of Agony? It's the reset version of High Tide. Oh, the like win in when you're winning your draw step kind of deck. Like, wasn't it like the deck that uh, didn't play Ponder, right? Weird, yeah. Um, you know what? Let me, let me, let me see how much <laughs> I can buy those. Um, God, like, I'm seriously buying like Laboratory Manic on Magic Online right now. Please don't be more than two tickets. I dare you. I dare you, Jace. Lab. Oops. Labora. Laboratory Maniac. So, we have Innistrad. Of course, we go Innistrad. Okay. Boom. Oh, he is worth... 0.01 tickets so this this disrespectful dude so disrespectful laboratory maniac 0.01 tickets literally for free okay well jace wielder of mysteries dude, i feel sorry for you this is a rare card okay jace oh shit okay well now it's it, it went up to like a whole ticket This is so this is so bad. This is this is this is just bad deck building, holy shit. Okay. So this one ticket, this is for you all, okay? So is gonna gonna spend this whole one ticket for this nonsense. But you know what? I love it. So let's do it. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Wait, solitary confinement, that's the card. Got half of high Wait. Have it right there. What's the doomsday deck? Run this and stifle back. And stifle even? Solitary confinement? Wait, that that's the enchantress enchantment, right? The three mana one? Oh god. <laughs> this 
else. That's six spells with the brainstorm, Rubus Petal, and Dark Control are played twice. I cast Doomsday for Storm, Count, and four remaining mana for Lethal. Yeah, it sounds like some 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 big brain thing to do. <laughs> okay, so uh let us Let's see here. I don't think okay, so like we still like I know I know it's gonna weaken the deck, okay, without Task Oracle, but I'm not saying that we are doing like an 0-4-0-5 league, right? Like we're trying to win still, right? So I'm gonna try to build like the most powerful deck here without playing Thousand Oracle. And I think the winning recipe probably starts. Oh shit, I did I forget to buy um what's it called again? Cloud Fairies again? Prop I do I even need Cloud of Fairies in this deck? I wonder. Ah, I might, I might. I might. If you go with Lab Man, you should also add a Chromatic Sphere. Whoa, that's a good, that's a good input. Oh yeah. Um, the so for, for everyone who doesn't know, because you lived under a rock. So um, Lab Man, if that boy dies with the, um with my draw on the stack or whatever, um, I, I lose. Okay, so Chromatic Sphere. The circumvent that step because um, it is we draw a card, but it is a mana ability, so opponent can't respond to that draw. So smart, so smart. Uh, chromatic uh, sphere. It also has a sick ass artwork. I feel yeah, yeah. If um from way back from invasion, is this invasion? Oh yeah, of course it's invasion. And uh, cloud of fairies. So. Cloud Fairies, <laughs> a ridiculous uh, magic card here. So it is a two mana one one fly. When it comes into this battlefield, I think you untap a land or something. Uh, when it enters the battlefield, untap up to two lands. Okay, so un untap the um, an underground sea and the um, Sheldok Isle, right? And then you get to Emerald Call them right away. That is at least the plan. I don't I don't know if we need this card to be completely honest. Uh uh Well, you know. Who cares? Okay, that's another whole ticket in the bin. In the trash can. In the trash can. If you have ever played with Cloud of Paris, type it in the chat right now. I I'm I would be Curious if any one of y'all plays with that magic card like ever before. Uh, what is it? <laughs> cloud, 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 cloud. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, god. Cloud of fairies. The, uh, chromatic sphere in. Chromatic sphere in. Lab man. Lab man in. I wonder if we still need Jace. Cloud Fairies is banned in Pauper, I think. Oh wow, is, is it really that good? Did it untap too many Shadow Isles? It was it was good in High Tide at some point, when, like 20 years ago. Oh, there's a card from Usa's, uh, Usa's block too, so. Damn. Like, so you had Time Spiral, Turnabout. And Cloud of Fairies, like all in the same block. Like, how? What in the world? <laughs> we didn't tap the old Ravnica Bounce Lands. Okay, well, that makes. Yeah. Yeah, at least produces mana. Um, not sure if you need Cloud of Fairies, to be honest with you. Um, Laboratory Mana seems sweet with Chromatic Sphere. I'm, I'm definitely want to try this one out. Um, <clears throat> I just simply don't know if you can, like, reasonably cast this Jay's Wheel, uh, Wheel of. Like, this. Look at the mana cost. It's like triple blue. Like, how am I supposed to produce triple blue with this deck? <laughs> it's like, there's like no way. Like, I need like I need the quad. Um, yeah, the quad uh, LEDs here. Otherwise, um, it's not gonna happen. Oh, treachery too, treachery dude. Yeah, man, what a good cube draft card. What a good uh. Deep analysis and consider isn't really convenient for for Labman and Jane's pilots. Yeah, I yeah yeah yeah. I, I gotta start like cutting cards 
Um, try three wishes, perhaps. <laughs> what is three wishes? <laughs> God. I am. I'm so scared. Like, so many cards that I haven't really, like, seen in my life. So, three wishes. What is three wishes? That sounds like a... Oh, okay. So, it is a magic card. Three wishes is... An instant for three mana. There we go again. Double blue mana symbol. Exile the top three cards of your library face down. You may look at those cards for as long as they remain exiled. And until your next turn, you may play those cards. At the beginning of your next upkeep, put any of those cards you didn't play into your yard. Okay, so you're saying this is like strictly worse ideas and bound. Right? Uh, why exactly do I have to play this card? <laughs> Question mark. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Um, more bad blue cards. Yeah, that's what I'm here for. That's what I'm here for. This is, this has like exactly one upside, and it is a perfect forcible pitch card. That's like that's it. <laughs> it is a. It has a gross artwork. What is even going on? I can't even tell what's going on. Um, yeah, so... You can use LED as a Lotus. Um, I pretty much have to, right? Cool thing is LED taps exactly for, for Maniac. That's kind of nice. Pretty sure so you, you can cast that Maniac and Jace with, with LEDs. Oh! Sure, I can do that. Yeah. Um, but you know what? I... Um, I feel like with Chromatic Sphere and Lab Man, you probably want more lands in your deck. Um, because this is like, this is like a lot of, it's a lot of mana. Like, I, sorry, I don't feel very confident, like, going, like, turn one Doomsday, honestly, with, like, con within conditions this expensive. Um, part of me wants, like, also, like, Jam, Emrakul, cool. I also, and Cloud Fairy is also in the main deck. I kind of like it as, like, a, like, a plan B, sort of, you know? Um, like against a deck with let's say like a lot of spot removal like if I play against a deck with like a lot of like pyroblasts and lightning bolts this guy will not survive like ever hmm. this is tough this is so tough also like do do I want so if maniac is in the deck do I also want cavern souls in the main I, I might I might want and for a human wizard I might want it you should play Door to Nothingness as your win con, just saying. <laughs> it wasn't like a ridiculous ridiculous uh, um, artifact or something, Door to Nothingness. I mean, you all want to see me suffer, right? Like, <laughs> what on earth is this nonsense? Okay, well, this is, um, holy shit. A 5 man artifact, draw to nothingness, and there's a battlefield tapped. White, white, blue, blue, black, black, red, red, green, green, tapped. Sacrifice all to nothingness. Target player loses the game. Cool. So you, so you want me to put like 10 LEDs on my deck? <laughs> First time chat, hey! Uri Sauce, why no fish? Oh, dude, uh, this is the challenge for today. You know, people people um, commented um, or like said to me in, in this like past whole year. Yeah, winning with Das Oracle is way too easy in Legacy, right? You know, like, like a card made Doomsday like hell of an easy deck to play. And I strictly disagree. And I wanna like showcase today how we can win. <laughs> Hopefully, win with Doomsday without any Thassus Oracle, okay? And like, I, I simply wanna prove the world that Thassus Oracle is not the problem. Uh, in, in columns it is, so. Um, no, Dual to Nothing is, is, dude, like, I can't, like, I can't do this. This is, this is like, this is, this is, <laughs> I need, like, 10 LEDs and 20 chromatic spheres to make this card work. Holy crap, dude. It, and it, it even enters the, ta that we tapped. Holy shit. This is, why? Like, why were magic cards so bad back in the day? Like, this was printed in, two, uh, what, what is it, M13, and... 2021, they print Thassus Oracle. It was no, what is it? Was it 2020? I don't remember. But you know, it's so weird. <laughs> Coalition victory then. <laughs> I was, I was just gonna say that. I was just gonna say that. Why has no one mentioned Coalition Relic? <laughs> Holy shit! 
Yeah, I know. Collision victory. <laughs> oh gosh. No, let okay, so let's cut deep analysis. Let's also cut considers. Consider is not needed in this in this deck, I feel. Pack of negation, maybe. Let's see. Ghost on Tutor can still grab Doomsday. Um I want Lapman, Chromatic Sphere. I also want Emrakul, Sherlock Isle, and Cloud of Fairies, I feel. Potentially. Ah, uh, maybe not. Hmm. This is this is rough. Ooh, maybe I do want, uh, since I have Laboratory Manic, maybe I do want Predict and Unearth. Yeah. Because that's, cause that's cheaper, right? Yeah, that's way cheaper. Unearth, come on. I might have Unearth in my collection. Uh, quantity up to, up to one. Oh, you only mentioned it twice? Holy shit, sorry. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. We got Unearth. Yes. And Predict. Holy shit. That's... Wait. Are we way too smart for this? Was like... Was like Thassa's Oracle never the issue? Okay. So now we can cut this whole Emrakul nonsense. Get out of here. We should go to the sideboard. Oh, yeah. Okay. So Emrakul back in the sideboard. We have, so we have Kavanaugh Souls in the main deck, we have um, Laboratory Maniac, we have a Predict alongside Ideas. I don't even know if we need Ideas and Bound. Maybe. Uh, predict is there. So we predict away the, the Lab Man and then we draw on Earth and we cast on Earth. That's like three mana. And um, we predict and draw on Earth plus Pact of Negation. Oh, wow, that's that's good. That's good. Oh, wait, no, we, we need to also. I, I guess we need to predict into Laboratory Maniac and uh, Chromatic Sphere, maybe? Like Chromatic Sphere, unearth this fella and then activate or something like that. You're gonna figure it out. And I like the, the many free draw effects, although one could be Bobble instead. Ooh, I like I do like Bobble instead of... Uh, we got a new follow <laughs> Hey, Pitchula do Amor. Pitchula underscore do underscore Amor. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Mm. We got a new follow. Man, deck's too spicy. I almost fake dropped my whole time. Hey, fake Kaitano. Thank you so much for the follow. How is it going, buddy? And how, how are you guys liking this monster of a deck? How are we liking it? Enrique, your will chromatics chromatic be better than a sim simple cycler Ooh, because opponents can't like they can bolt they can't now they can't bolt maniac in response because the draw here is built in the mana ability so i crack this and my opponent doesn't get priority so i simply win the game otherwise this is a pretty shitty magic card it does have some sickest artwork though so that's a plus um yeah So, choo -choo 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 -choo. all in all, not too bad. Um, not sure if you need this many cyclers. Um, you might want to shave a couple of those. Hmm. How important are six, six cyclers? Like we only have, we only have four brains on four ponder. We have Predict, which is kind of hard to set up. You have an Unearth, which, which can also cycle. Like, we, have, we have like a lot of like cycling-ish cards, right? Like those cards that draw a card at random. I don't want to play a, more, a couple more Preordains, but maybe that's uh, too much luxury. Or like turn those personal tutors into Preordains. I don't know. I don't know. You know what? Um, I'm almost almost set with this list. I, we should probably add a 15th cycle card. That'd be smart. Kind of like a small thing to do. Why don't we add? Uh, what is what is a good sideboard card? <laughs> what is a good sideboard card? I I don't even know. How the hell? Man, maybe another discard spell. No. Hmm. Chain of vapor. Sure, you got it. Let's do it. In a vapor. That's a good call. Um, 
There you go, buddy. Shitty Vapor. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, yeah, okay, cool. Let's give this a try, I would say. Um... Yeah. Predict, Unearth, Chromatic Sphere, Ideas and Bound, Lab Man, 6 Cyclers, 9 Countess, 2 Discard, 15 lands including Cavern of Souls. Um, I almost... Ah... Uh, I kind of want to play Basic Island in this deck list because of like Predict, Ma a Maniac being like, you know, a little cost intensive. Yeah, I kind of... Let me let me cut the red uh, let me cut the the red spells here. I prefer basic lands in this deck. Uh, I guess volcanic island can always be in the sideboard. Yeah, that's probably even better than chain of vapor. Okay, volcanic island alongside the the three red cards in the sideboard. Boom! This looks this looks a lot better. Hey KW Twitch, how is it going, buddy? Good day, afternoon, night. It is a beautiful night. It is uh, 11 p.m. in Tokyo. Oh, no. wow. DJ underscore DJ Twitches. Twitch, thank you so much for tuning in, my friend. When do you use the LED? I almost never want to use it, to be honest. <laughs> this might be like this might be like the the, uh, the last emergency um, card if we absolute have to go for like a speed kill with Lab Man. Um, what am I watching you, dude? Adam, welcome to the show, my friend. I, dude, this this is this is what you all wanted. So sacrilegious, dude. This is so. This is. <laughs> this is the actual worst, my friend. This is the actual worst. Like you all want to know, you all want to see like one thing, and it, it's it's disgusting. It's disgusting. It's doomsday without that's roll call. Cool. I guess your second response is to the cycle effect. Yeah, well, I guess, I guess. Let me lock this one in and let's, let's rock this thing through a leak here. Okay. Okay, so before I start... Lab man, perfect. Before, so before I start the first match, I, I give you 30 seconds, okay, to everyone in the chat to write your... <laughs> to write down... Our final record, okay? What is what do you predict? What is our record after five rounds with this monster of a deck? I'm gonna show you the deck list right here. Okay? No Thus Oracle. We have Laboratory Maniac, we play Chromatic Sphere, we play Predict, we play Unearth, we play a whole lot of nonsense. What is our final record? I give you 30 seconds starting now. Come on. I'm gonna add. I'm gonna add my own. Boom. <laughs> Come on. Go on the side shoot kick or don't I show Kakono Kono Deki de Ima Chatani Kai Tik Tikuda Sai. Hello, Prasatani. Thank you so much for the for, for the first time chat. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> 20 more seconds. Mm. Um, you got 10 more seconds. Come on, everyone. I mean, like, look, yeah, please don't forget, it is still Savatarix, you know, playing the sex, so, you know, we, 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 we gotta, we, we gotta accomplish something here. <laughs> we got the mastermind right here. Okay, three, two, one, boom, done. Okay, all right, what do we have? So we have Adam, two, three, disrespectful, this was, just get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> you got a 1-4? What? 1-4? That's not even like... Wait, like, do I even get something for... I don't think I get any anything for 1-4. Damn. 5-0 <laughs> sweep, dude. Yeah. A7 Molten. Yeah, dude. Like that. Yeah, slap it. Slap it. Kiwi Twitch 3-2. Well, that's a... Uh, kind of modest answer for Satani. 5-0 for sure, dude. Yeah, yeah. Mario, for, nice, 4-1, four, 4-1, one, four, one. if we get 4-1 with this deck, I'd be, I'd be over the moon, okay, Dr. Janity, 5-4, okay, well, you know what, let's kick that baby, let's kick it. Imagine cycling with an empty library and then getting dressed down, oh my gosh, it's like, wait, is, is this why you type 2-3? <laughs> 
Oh gosh. Well, yeah, well, you know, you made a huge mistake because it, it, it is Sawatarix playing this ridiculous deck, so... You know, better be... A 3-2. <laughs> oh god. <sighs> By the way, ha have you guys seen that there is... There is a Legacy Super Qualifier this weekend? Yikes, there... This is like a... This is like a big Legacy event, and... Like, uh, high stakes, I think you, you can, like, win a Pro Tour invite or something like that. I don't know. Dude, it's gonna be infested, the frag event. I'm telling you. That's gonna be infested. Uh, I gotta see. Maybe, maybe, I, maybe I will play. Uh, maybe not. Maybe I'll stream. Maybe I'm gonna stream and, um... Play lap, man. <laughs> oh, God. I guess you don't instantly lose to Endurance. Well, that's a good point. Yeah, I don't instantly lose. I... I have to keep this 2-2 uh, fella on the board for like a couple turns though. Have you tried Doomsday with 4 gut shots in the 75? I have not. And Oh, against Raggy Man? Uh, no. <laughs> but I wouldn't mind because it also shoots down Alessaur Shepard and Alessaur Shepard is such a bitch. Okay, welcome everyone, it's your boy Kaiser Watari, aka Saltarix and Magic Online bringing you the Doomsday Hype. Today we're playing first match, Doomsday without Thassa's Oracle. This is, 20, this is the year 2022 and we say no to fishies for today, okay? We stay vegetarian. We won the die roll. We have a strong, reasonable hand. In fact, this is a turn... This is close to a turn 2 kill. I'm 100% gonna keep this. I'm gonna leave the thoughts. He's gonna, gonna see what um, what I'm up against. Especially after opponent, opponent took a uh, mulligan to 6. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Hit ya. What do we got? What? Who is our first content? What the hell? What's the plus a uh, pitch ponder? Why do people do something like that? This is so... Like... What a yucky play. <laughs> Force pitch Ponda on a Thoughtseize? What is happening? Dell of Secrets, holy shit. Okay, well that's, that's the enemy right there. That's the enemy right there. Not sure if, if Labman is good enough, to be honest with you. Um, also, like, Tropical Island Delver is... That's a statement. That is a statement. Let us go... Let's see. Let us go on the first. And then um, cast Postman Tutor later. Okay, dude. Oh, wow. We, we found Doomsday. We also find Mr. Ring. This is, this is a perfect pond. Okay, I guess Postman Tutor... That's gonna be a pitch card. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I want to do it like this. And why don't we thought seize them immediately? Let's see. Hmm. Yeah, it's okay. You know what? I I think we should wait. Next turn, we we thought seize them. And then the turn off, uh, the turn later, we go off. How do we not doomsday turn one? Well, you know, guess what? <laughs> guess what? Like, I don't, I don't know if we want to doomsday turn one with this deck. <laughs> this is, this deck is we super fragile. Okay. <laughs> Swamp Bass eighty four. Hey, Swamp Bass forty eight eighty four. Thank you so much for the follow. Appreciate it. This is a Canadian threshold. Can we please see like a nimble mongoose? <laughs> you morally have to. <laughs> That's what the card says. Yeah, it's like a secret pack. I mean, every time you draw it, you gotta you gotta have to ca cast it. Uh oh yeah, oh the person like the person name literally says calm rock. Okay, well. Imagine if I named myself like Doomsday. Doomsday.com. Okay, so. Thoughties. 
Three cards in hand. Might hit something. They forced the first Tartsies. Maybe this one gets forced too. No. Hopefully they don't, they don't play something stupid like Stifle. Oh god. Spell Pierce. Who plays Spell Pierce in 2020? I think both days. Well... Gonna take the Spell Pierce, I, I assume. Yeah. Who the hell plays Spell Pierce? <laughs> okay, so... We know about Day's Lightning Bolt. Okay, that's that's good for me. Um, hopefully, they don't they don't draw a wasteland. Otherwise, I think we might be in good shape. <laughs> Double play a raging against the machine. Oh yeah, good band, good music. Haven't listened to um, to that. Ooh! This is for Nimble Bob Goose. The Nimble Nim. The Goose is loose. <laughs> People, stop complaining about Nim uh, about Raggy Man. Okay, well, this is the most solid blocker ever. It has Shroud. Like, how can you ever deal with Nimble Mong Mongoose? I was, I, was almost, I was almost gonna say Nimble Monger Van. What year is this? This is so freaking flavorful. They play Nimble Mongoose. I play Lab Man. Okay, well, it doesn't get more old school than that okay this is this is dude opponent's ready i'm ready so um oh yeah oh yeah okay so what i'm gonna do here get that underground seed let's see so can i i have to do some i have to do some new math so i cast doomsday they days probably i force back boom Doomsday resolves. Okay, then now what? I go down to what? Like, this is to 9 life to 4 life. Right? Shit. Which means I can't street rate because both is lethal. Um. Holy shit. Bolt is lethal. How in the world am I supposed to beat Lightning Bolt? End days. That's a super tricky question. Wait, so what if I Doomsday, the days, I force, and then I pass turn? No, that's that that's a stupid idea as well. LED somehow? What do you mean? Could you crack LED in cycle while holding priority? I Sure, I could, but like, I then the the bolt mean response, and I pay for days. Uh could you crack LED in cycle in cycle while holding priority? Yeah, y yeah. Pass turn, hope to draw a land and force the bolt. Oh, I mean, they're gonna first of all, like they they're gonna daze my doomsday. I got I gotta protect my doomsday. <laughs> oh no no oh pass and hope uh hope to draw land ah oh, gotcha 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 okay 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 so if i pass turn they hit me for what for four i go down to six life i take my turn hopefully draw a land which is not guaranteed and then i go doomsday go down to this is so ambitious though doomsday and, and rave on doomsday and rave on stack crack LED go from there Doomsday and Wraith on stack. I have to... You know, but like, Wraith is always gonna resolve first. No matter how you do it. So I'm gonna draw like a random card? Is, is that what you're saying? What do, you uh, do you consider hard to pilot Doomsday or at nauseum? I feel, I mean, in this game state, definitely at um, Doomsday, but like, at nauseum is also like a bitch sometimes. Was it a mistake to not take the days here? Uh, it, yeah, it might have been. I didn't know that they played Nimble Mongoose, but... You can't break before Doomsday Resolve. Right. You can't. So I'm, I'm kind of like trapped here. I'm kind of trapped. I'm, I can't cast Doomsday. Because they will daze it. Like, even if I play out... Like, let's say I play out the LED and then I cast Doomsday, then what? I mean, then they're gonna say, okay, Resolves. 
and and then I have to like I can't pass the turn because I'm you know gonna die. Ah, uh, maybe I don't. Let's see. If I play LED and I play Doomsday, and let's say they don't daze, okay, for whatever reason, can I? Uh, they might. I don't know. I go down to five life. They will lightning bolt me. I will force that going down to four, and then you know, and this is for power, so I I, I lose no matter what. Not sure. LED first play Doomsday, and you can then you can cycle and force the bolt. How? Yeah, but what if they force? And uh, what if they bolt me after I have discarded my hand? Because I have to discard my hand if I want to cycle, right? What I can do, okay, I want, want one little trick here. Maybe, maybe I can trick them. Okay, what if I go Doomsday, the days? Oh, no, 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 that was stupid. No, I can't. My opponent is bad. <laughs> I can't assume. That he may have. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I think, I think I'm gonna pass turn here. Because I don't see how we can win this turn. I, I, I can't see how we are um, dealing with this lightning bolt. I just can't see how this is ever going to happen. So if we draw one more land, then at least we, we, we can uh, ignore the days, and then we can focus our force on Lightning Bolt only. Maybe they Lightning Bolt me now. If I pass turn, they might even like end up turn Lightning Bolt me, and like that, that'd be totally cool, I think, right? 1, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, I go down to 3 life. Oh, I guess that's not really cool because I don't I can't cycle anymore. But you get the you get the idea. Maybe cycle now. Ooh. Wow. To hit to hit what? I don't think we we, we can cycle now. To draw the, the bolt out or draw a land. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna pass here. I'm gonna pass here and hope to draw a land and then Hopefully win somehow, but uh, I can't. I currently can't beat both days and lightning bolt. I feel. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny though. Like, so, like Chad is going like all crazy because of, of like of like ridiculous uh, <laughs> doomsday lines that don't work. It's kind of funny. I mean, including myself. I I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> Nimble mongoose, dude. Nimble manga van. I'm telling you, if this card was printed in 2020, I said it like multiple times in my, in my previous streams. If this card was printed in 2022, this card had 10 more lines of text, okay? This card would, it would say, it draws a card when it enters the battlefield. You, um, It has a static ability which says, when every opponent cracks a fetch land, counter that ability. And every time it attacks, you also gain 3 life and you can put a land into play. And it also has dash for 2 mana. And it's obviously a 4-4 already for 1 mana. It doesn't even have threshold. That would be Nimble Mongoose in 2022. Or let me call it Nimble, Nimble Manga Ban. Alright. Okay, this is the moment of truth. Uh, I mean, this is not... I guess... That's good. What's so what's what's the line for it? Like what's the line here? So we go for we go LED. Hmm. What's the line here? We cast Doom. No, we, we cast LED. No wait, we cast Doomsday. The days I force. No 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 no. no. I play LED. I play LED. I play Doomsday. The days I force. And then I then I got priority, so I got I have to I can double cycle. Oh they they can they can both in response. Yeah, they don't oh, I mean I, I go down to three life, remember. But uh Bulletin Bolt's lethal. Uh, don't think I can beat Cyclist like 2 life.
Uh... Yeah, but like, they will bolt me in before I even cycle. <laughs> um... This is hella tricky. I don't... <laughs> Like, if I Doomsday and then I, I cycle afterwards and crack LED in response, they, they will bolt me in response and I, I die. <laughs> oh god. Hey, first time chat. Nidia Hiske, thank you so much for the, for the first time chat. Hope you're enjoying this, this, this nonsense here. <laughs> I think you're all missing the point that, like, we are about to lose half of our lives. We are about to go down to, like, three life, right? So, <laughs> I might have to three brave now. So, we have, um, yeah, I want to hit a land. Let us cycle now. I hope we draw. Okay, well, this is a mana source. If we fetch, we go down to 3 life, 2 life. Yeah, it's... it's... Okay, now, also we going down to 3 life. So if they want to lightning bolt me now, that would be super good for me. That would be super, super good for me. Uh... So Doomsday, they can technically bolt me in response. We are dead if they lightning bolt me after yeah after I play LED and crack right, like we can beat them if they bolt me like right here like I'm I'm literally like representing three life here. This is like this is the easiest for my opponents. Like it is so like telling. Hey, it's just I'm here. Just freaking shoot me, dude. Like I'm like arms are up. <laughs> I got, I got, I got nothing, dude. There is, dude. Yeah, of course, I'm, of course, I'm gonna pay, idiot. <laughs> Duh. So now what? Shit. Okay, resolve. That's a problem. That is a problem. I didn't want this to happen. But, well. So let's see. Um, I think the pile has to be unearthed. <laughs> uh, predict. Oh, this is a wild, this is a wild pile. So let's see. If the Arch of Autumn and into predict, cast it to get rid of um bottom the um drop the maniac draw. Edge of Autumn and Unearth. Oh, we still can't win, can we? Because like, watch. I need. I need to empty my library. There's no win here. Yeah, I don't think we can win here. Or can I? Let's see. Can Can I do something with Ideas Unbound? Maybe. Ideas Unbound. In. What if I cycle into Ideas Unbound? Draw into. Maniac, I have one more. Maniac, into Maniac, Lotus Petal, Lotus Petal. No, that doesn't work either. Oh shit, I'm dead. I think I'm dead no matter what. Yeah, uh, the last card needs to be a Cycler, but I can't. I, I need a third Edge of Autumn. It was a 1 2, one, two turns earlier with Tendrils in the deck. <laughs> Okay, well, in, in that case, I'm gonna concede before showing my deck to my opponent. Right. I'd rather not show them um, that we don't have Thus Oracle in, my, in our deck. Right? <laughs> okay, so this is regular Canadian Threshold. Um, against which I do like um, Duress Effects. I also do like Pacts quite a bit. I also might like this extra land. Let's see. I like the spices, dude. <laughs> like, if if laboratory manic was was a was a was a spice, what flavor would this be? 
you better not say salt or something like that. <laughs> like what flavor? Like what kind of spice are we talking here? <laughs> oh gosh. Um, listen to her out. Thanks for your subscription. Mm -hmm. Hey, Prosokin, thank you so much for the Prime sub. <laughs> Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Oh, Volcanic Island. Oh, well, I guess I'm, I'm still gonna add it. They, they are Wasteland Stifle deck, so... I don't mind. Chromatic Sphere definitely has to stay in. Those cards are all good. Close to the Street Grace are a little too... Ex too um, painful maybe those packs are a little too much maybe yeah i might like this they are not super aggressive if like you know they're not a ragavan deck so i might like the setup here <laughs> dude yeah close to the 10k bank robbery did i tell everyone so i, I told in this discord um that once you hit 10k subscribers on twitch I'm gonna rob a bank and I'm still looking for people who want to join me Do we have people in the chat who have like experience with like robbing banks? Because uh... I mean in movies it looks all easy Thoughties is good Thoughties is very good Oh, yeah. Like, if they go Misty, Misty Pass, oh my gosh. Um, like, this, this, is, this is gonna be stifle, right? It's, it's gonna be. Oh, I almost don't want to crack it, honestly. Yeah, let's chill. Um, like, don't even. Yeah, don't even wanna force him to do something. Weak feet, weak morals. I see. Wait, what? No, this is just good, <laughs> good gameplay. <laughs> like, if if my Delva opponent wants to like spend turns doing nothing, I'm totally fine with that. I should probably. This might be a good turn for for Panda. Doomsday Force ideas unbound. So, ah, uh, sure. Um, yeah, that's. Hmm. I would say that's just good enough. <coughs> oh. Remember, we want to we want to draw that blue card from the top, so we have a false pitch. Okay, well that's a devil. That's okay. 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 Spell pierce. I almost want to pay. I almost want to pay. Like, pay honest mana. Um, here's like this is not a threat at all. And and if they wanna like throw a, another daze at my thoughts, is I'm totally fine with that. Yeah, sure. Okay, that was a good trade. That was a good trade. They went down on resources. Um. We have dodged two counters. That's good. Oh, and Delva didn't flip. Okay, well, that's like all good signs. All good signs. I don't care if they waste me. Okay. Man, Del like Delva, like old classic Rock Delva is such a different animal than like Blue Red Delva these days. It is so different. I, I almost want to jam this Doomsday in the dark now. Yeah, why not? You got nothing to lose. If they want to daze this, like, be my guest. 
I like I want them to come to the Oh yes, perfect. Okay. Yeah. Let's try. Perfect. Okay, we we took another counter. Okay, double again didn't flip. It's good. Must be my lucky day. Must be our lucky day. <laughs> No play, no creature, no cantrip, no nothing. Um, five cards in hand. Do we want to wait until we have another, another blue card so we have, we can go double force protection? I kind of want to wait. I kind of want to wait. Right. If that Delva flips next turn, then we have to make a move. But like as for as for now, I, I don't feel like we are like we need to do something. We can chill. Endurance hotcast. Well, that's a statement. They run endurance, huh? Well, okay, they got endurance. That's good to know. <laughs> I guess this beats Nimble Mongoose. <laughs> The question is, like, do they want even more, like, use this ability on, on me? I don't think so. Yeah. Okay, they revealed this. Glad we have so much mana. Like, Endurance is a weird card to play in Rock Delva, I feel. Okay, well, this is... Absolutely perfect. I uh, wish we had a little more mana. So we can't... Hmm. I can't dress Doomsday and, and win on the same turn, unfortunately. Hey, Bird7770, what up? What up? What up? Hey, today, today is your lucky day. Today we are no... We are playing the Doomsday No Thus Oracle gang. That's the plan for today. No Thus Oracle, okay? I want to prove the world that... Doomsday can win without Blast Oracle. <laughs> Are you with me today? Um, let's let's go ahead and okay. So what if I duress them this turn? They go down. Um, I go down the crack the Kraken for six points. I go down to four life. It that doesn't kill me. I guess I can rest them this turn and then I go off next turn. <laughs> Let's see. We know opponent has a days. What is happening? Counters! Actual factual counter spell. Holy mother of god. What is what is going on? Uh my wincon is um I got Laboratory Maniac, plus Predict, plus Unearth, plus Chromatic Sphere, and I got Shadow Gal Emrakul. These are the these are the win conditions for today. Holy sh holy mother of God! I think I'm supposed to counter spell that. I'm like, uh, actually, no. Let's scratch that. Yeah, that's fine. The actual factual counter spell is wild. <laughs> okay, we're gonna take a truckload of damage here. Remember, they, they have five cards, one of them is a daze, so... Okay. Also, Lightning Bolt is lethal. Okay, Edge of Autumn is a good draw.
Not sure if you, if you wanna if you wanna undo some bond first because then um you make your um your dark witch a little vulnerable to days if you don't hit a land, right? Yeah, like they they have a days. We know about the days. But does every single player of Doomsday player that accept art of Dark Rituals? Oh, cause it's... I have two favorite Dark Ritual arts. Okay, we can also discard Dark Ritual arts. I have two absolute favorites. This is this is number one. And the other Dark Ritual I, I absolutely love is the one from Mirage. Um, that one is beautiful. Okay, so okay, well... Guess what? Okay. Actually, wait. Can I? Am I allowed to pay? Should I really click yes? Uh, am I? Shit, okay. I can't force the days anymore, but that's fine. I th yeah, okay. I guess I'm gonna pay. Um, I was thinking about like forcing that days, but they have like five more cards. They have technically four more spells. Don't know what they're cooking with. There are a couple of cards I can't beat. The Flusher Storm I can't beat. That can both mean response. <laughs> That's funny. Um, this I have to force. Because otherwise, like, um, Doomsday will kill me. Okay, so if they have anything else, then I'm dead. Yeah, okay, well. Ah, uh, I can, I guess I can technically cycle into Miracle. Ah, <laughs> uh, God. <laughs> Funny. Oh gosh. Okay, I guess we lost the nimble mongoose. <laughs> oh god. I love the tempest art. Mirage is up there too. Yeah, the tempest one. Oh yeah, that guy. Like, who goes like? Right. Shit. We already broke, broke, uh, broke the law. The law says. The law says everyone who plays laboratory manic instead of uh Thousand oracle has to go 5-0 and trophy because that's when people are gonna see deck lists now no one's gonna see the deck list how do we ever get famous with laboratory maniac if no one sees the deck list <laughs> welcome to number round number dross this is your boy playing for the quote unquote like half trophy this is a turn one doomsday with backup let's do this um, a little tricky because it doesn't have any lands, but we're gonna figure it out. And also, like, we are, we are so pro, we're gonna probably rip underground seed from the top anyway. Is there an actual reason for laugh, man, or is it just a meme? This is, oh, I mean, I would never do memes. Wasteland. Rocks Diamond. Okay, well. You know, can't waste anything if you don't have any lands. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, okay. I think we're doing it. So let us they got two cards in hand. I think it doesn't it doesn't hurt if we go Dark Ritual Thoughtsies then right? Yeah, I think it doesn't hurt. Okay, they got nothing. Cool. Okay, so let's see. They got a what what was it? Close quarter in the like uh, the Yavi Maya, okay. So it has to be, where is it? Who are you, buddy? Lab man. And... Do I want to go unearth? Like, unearth is kind of scary against, like, crop rod for Juka Bog. <laughs> uh... What is the best pile for... We got wasted and ghost quarter, so I 
Like what is yeah, what is the best pile we can make here? Maybe it is on Earth. Like we got you got zero lands in play. <laughs> I guess fetch lands, island, misty, underground. No 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 no. That's not gonna work. That is not gonna work. See, I think we should probably abandon a couple of lands here and play lotus petals instead. What about this? Pedal Pedal Delta Island and Laboratory Maniac. This is hella slow though. Like why is deck so slow? <laughs> Dude, don't, we don't talk about that. We don't talk about three Delta Swans on the trend. If that is that, that is like a, a banned a banned topic. <laughs> I need a cycler, yeah. So are we are we wanna like are we gonna do something like this? Edge laboratory manic pedal pedal island? And I'm gonna pass like what like five turns? I'm not gonna pass five turns. <laughs> Dude, laboratory manic is, is is hella complicated. How do we how do we this is like lands. I don't know if in the past you don't lose the punishing fire. Sure, but then we lose the crop rod, don't we? And also like, you got zero lands in play, so... If we have like land... What if we have like... Land... Land... Or like, pedal pedal, if you will. And we cast predict. Bottom the... I guess that works. Yeah, okay, so we go pedal pedal... And we cast predict bottom the maniac draw two cards, a running two cards, which is like a cycler and unearth. No, that doesn't work either because we also need mana for unearth. Oh man, that's that's crazy bad. Holy shit. No ideas. With, no ideas with. Wait, what? Yeah, we have predict in hand. I don't, th I don't think this, all this is gonna like work out. Like there's no way we, we can survive five turns against lands. They're gonna do something. Can you crack LED someone responds to cycle effect? I can, I can. Uh, diamond, diamond if ideas and bond on the stack. Doesn't cheese a win, so... So we go and pedal, pedal, and then we cast Ideas Unbound for three cards, right? So we draw... Lab... No, that doesn't work. Like, LED, Lab Man, Cyclone, that doesn't work. We, we have to, like... This is not Black Lotus, we have to kind of, like, circumvent that step. <laughs> Oh, dude, yeah, take it sleazy, take it sleazy. Can you crack it and just second effect someone and then play lab and pass a turn? We could. Huh. Maybe this Edge of Autumn doesn't belong here. Maybe this needs to be a fetch land to, so we can speed up everything by a turn. Brainstorm, huh? They got, go but they got like ghost water and loam. Like I can't, like we have to resolve this three mana clunky, super clunky dude. Like we can't get our, like they can even ghost water my island. So like, this is tough. I think I'm gonna like lock this one in and try to yeah and hope they don't do much <laughs> this is such terrible play though 
<laughs> Such terrible plans. Is there like, don't we have like any other alternative here? I feel like we need a uh, lab, man. Okay, okay, so he here's an idea. You know what? Um, screw this whole plan. We gotta, we gotta do something else. What about LED and lab, man? That's good. And we put in a bunch of cyclers. So like, I'm talking like, I don't know, like three cyclers here, for example. So next turn, we draw Street Wraith. The turn after, we draw LED. Then we Street Wraith, Crack LED, and cast Lab Man. Play Lab Man with zero cards in hand. And then the following turn, we draw Street Wraith into Street Wraith into we win the game. Okay, well, that's that's how we do it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, it's still... It's still crazy, crazy week, but okay. <laughs> I think I now start to to remember why Tassel's Oracle is so good. <laughs> you don't have to do this bullshit here. <laughs> oh god! Like opponent already like uh, went like chat like, do you win from this spot? I uh, well no, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for asking. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. What is happening? Oh, cyclone? Yeah. Oh, cr sh crop rod? Okay. What did I want to crop rod for? I wonder. I'm now, I'm super happy we didn't go for um, Unearth, by the way. They, cro uh, they, they topped the crop rod like immediately. I know playing Oracle occurs like, you know, Oracle is way too easy. I, I want to show you guys like, you know, that I'm really good with Doomsday. So I thought it'd be like a good idea if I can <laughs> showcase that a little bit. Which I'm not, by the way. Like, I, I'm, I'm kind of like failing the test here. But the, the mission is to, um, okay, to get a couple wins here. This oh, it stinks a little bit. Let's see. Can we... Uh... <laughs> there we go. There's lab man. Let me take us. Let me take us screenshot. Otherwise, people are not gonna believe me. <laughs> Oh shit, there's a problem. You guys, you know, you, you get you get something. I think I think we need to chump I need to think we need to chump lock this freaking construct. <laughs> oh fuck! The last two cards like two side oh <laughs> fucking spirit pirate spell bomb dude like who does shit like that? Oh no! Oh no! Not like that! Oh, not like that! Oh no! Pirate spell bomb! Pirate spell bomb! Oh no! Instantly punished! Instantly punished! Is this card like ever good? I wonder. Also, negations in. Thoughts is out. Unearth seems terrible against them. Um, well, what else is bad? Uh, I need to cut something else. I think I need either like a cycler or... <sighs> Magic Speed is like also like a bad card. I guess I have to cycle... I guess I have to cut like a daze maybe. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> I don't know if Doomsday was even playable. It was playable, but it was like tier 6. It was not. It was not tier one, and now I think we all understand. Start to realize like why that's the case, right? <laughs> that's the saddest board I've ever seen. Like, <laughs> oh god.
Oh god. No, it was like like whenever you rock up to like a 70 player tournament, there was like this one weirdo in the corner who, who played like Doomsday with Um Some weirdo piles. Okay, I'm gonna I guess oh, This has lands. It says lands and I can I can pull spheres. I guess I'm gonna keep it. It's a little slow, but that's okay. <laughs> Ideas on bound, huh? Okay, get that basic island right here. Okay. Doomsday Lord's Battle on one C. I love it. You love to see that. I gotta go. Screams like a power blast to me. Oh crap, rock. Next turn, it's Doomsday turn. And uh, we're gonna take it slow from there. Uh, no need to rush anything. Wasteland, okay, well. Screw you, Wasteland. So, Sphere of Resistance, not too scared of that card. Next turn, we, we, we can really play Doomsday. I don't think we care about Sphere. I mean, on the other hand, like, what am I gonna force of the gate anyway? Hmm. Like, this is not gonna protect anything. And if this resolves, my ideas and balance not gonna do anything. I, I guess I'm gonna force it anyway. So, um, the question now is I think I want to keep those two uncracked. Yeah. Put two underground seas in my pile as well. Okay, so <laughs> let's, let's try and do it again. Okay, so I want you, Maniac, and I also do want. Two fetchable lands. Underground sea and underground sea. Okay. Good. I do want that where is it? Chromatic sphere. And cavern of Ah, uh, I guess Pact's better. Pact of negation. How so how about this? Uh, Chromatic Sphere, Laboratory Maniac, Pact of Negation, Underground Sea, and Underground Sea. We can beat multiple Wastelands. We can beat Endurance or a Counter, and we can also beat Removal. Yeah. That's, I mean, it's gotta be good enough. Hopefully. Let's try it out. <laughs> well, another good thing about uh, Maniac is that it trades with Ragavan. <laughs> uh. Like, after seeing after seeing lab uh, Laboratory Maniac, po my opponents might take a little longer to check off my decklist <laughs> after resolving Doomsday. Shit. Oh, triple a uh, double wasteland? Wow. Yikes, okay. Well, I'm glad we put in some some extra lands in our pile. Can we... Yeah, I, I think we can beat this, still. Right. Hmm, but not... If, if they waste... So if they waste me... What, what is my pile still like? I got two under one C's. Lab man. Oh, and packed. Oh shit, if they waste me next turn, I can't win again. I think. Hmm, maybe they don't waste me. If they waste me, you don't have mana for, for Lab Man anymore. 
If we didn't count on the second sphere and, and, and plus the second wasteland. We got a new follower. Hey, thank you so much, pa Palomo3. Thank you so much for the follow, appreciate it. Um, yeah, don't think we can win with only three lands in play. We can't cast that stupid laboratory maniac. Ah, <laughs> oh, why are you so bad? Why is this magic card so bad? Why are you so freaking bad? <laughs> like, why? <laughs> Holy shit, this card is bad. Like, that Oracle would have won, like, all the games already. And this little stinker, like, it, it's not even like that. It's fragile. It, it's, it's, always, like, it's mana cost. Holy crap, dude. Like, three mana is such a big cost for a creature. Holy crap, this is bad. <laughs> <laughs> so who said who said you're gonna go five and zero? Dreams are crushed, dude. <laughs> oh god. Five four. This is this is what this is this is what we agreed on to the stream. This was the this was the promise. This was this was the promise I made at the beginning of the stream. You know, like I'm not gonna let you down, guys. But here you are. Because of a stupid moron. <laughs> uh. You cannot even think of one good thing about Manic. Well, I can think about two things, you know. You can pitch it to force. And you can pitch it to force. And oh, you know, guess what? There's another good thing. There's like three reasons why you should play Melvania. You can pitch to force. You can pitch it to force. And this guy blocks rag event. Boom. Got it. That's literally all the reasons why you should play this card. Nothing else. Like, give me another reason. You better be creative. <laughs> oh, God. You can block an unflipped double secrets. Well, there you go. You know, that's a good start. That's a good start. I would rather trade with Ragavan, but you know, blocking double is not it's not terrible. That's the that's the <laughs> that's like Merc that's no, that's the endurance before endurance. <laughs> Doesn't lose a topo. Oh, that's actually that's actually a good reason. Mixed up 5-0 and 0-5? I don't I don't I don't think I mean I don't you must be mistaken, my friend. <laughs> like I'm stupid, but I'm not that stupid. <laughs> uh When it trades with Ragavan, but Oracle murders Ragavan. Oh yeah, it eats it for breakfast. By the way, I didn't, I didn't even eat breakfast. I haven't, I haven't eaten breakfast in a long time. Maybe I want to do some breakfast tomorrow. It's close to midnight. I wonder what should I, what should I make? Let's see. Yo everyone, this is this your boy Kai in the round number tres with um good old maniac doomsday without Oracle cause like you know who gives a shit. We got Ponda, we got we got a good old cycler for two mana, let's kick it off. Natto gohan, natto gohan mo iyo ne. Natto gohan wa kekko tsuki kamo. Yeah, I love to eat natto for, for breakfast. Not gonna lie. Oh shit. <gasps> Can I unearth something? No. Oh, it says from your graveyard. Okay, well, my bad. I mean this is this is uh this is trouble. Shit, this is trouble. Let me ponder into into gas. This is this is not good enough. Force? Okay, well I at least I can like, you know, if they go for something, I can, I can like bring some response and hopefully hit days or something. Let's see. They got a Grizzle Daddy and Archon in the yard. What's the habit, right? Yeah. Come on, Brainstorm. Come on. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh lord. 
Oh lord, life is pain, dude. Life sucks and I'm ready to die. <laughs> oh, come on. Come on. I wonder what what they want to do. Um, gruesome, gruesome daddy or... Okay. Never mind. Never mind. Like, compare... Compare this fella to Lab Man. Like, do, do you guys see, like, the difference between, like, this creature right here and our stupid little Lab Man? <laughs> it's almost the same. It's almost the same. Like, it's, it's kind of hard to, like, you know, tell the difference sometimes, but, like... This guy has actually, like, some, some decent stats. <laughs> sadness has been put on this deck. Is there a magic card called Sadness? There might be. Like, I would not be surprised if there was a card called Sadness. And it's like... A creature gets, I don't know, like, minus one, minus one, and the turn. It's Abandoned Hope. Abandoned Hope, yeah. Uh... Unbeat this. Okay, at least... Against Reanimator, I don't think the downside of uh, Labman does a um, makes up a huge difference. Um, Horses in. Thoughts this is awful. We might even hit a random time Grizzle Daddy. Kevin is awful. Chromatic Sphere is also not needed against a deck without removal. I think we want to keep everything else. Uh, um, pack team is awful too. Then at least I want to bring in a dress, I think. Yeah, that's probably good enough. Bro, are you for the next meme stream? Doomsday, reanimate, regular Doomsday with one Grizzlebrand, one reanimate, and one loot. <laughs> I know, wait, like Julian? Julian Knob has the, has the ultimate, the ultimate Doomsday pile. It's, it's like, it's Siege Rhino, Siege Rhino, Siege Rhino, Siege Rhino, and then, um, the card that blinks all your permanents. A Yorian, yeah. <laughs> you play a Siege Rhino each turn, and then, you know, last card is Yorian, and you freaking blink all your Rhinos. It's like a, it's a five turn kill. Like, steady and slowly, but you know, at least you're consistent. Because people like consistent shit, you know, if, if you're like, even if it's not good, if you're consistent, it's like, it's true for all streamers, for YouTubers, for content creators, for literally musicians, for literally anyone who's out there doing anything online, if you're consistent, that's good. So, and Siege, I can't even think of anything more consistent than Siege Rhinos. Okay, this is a clear keep to me. This is a clear keep. We got a counter, we got fast mana, we also have a turn to Doomsday if you want to. Uh, looks crisp to me. Oh man, can't believe we lost to Pirate, uh, Pirate Spellbomb. <laughs> okay, opponent's taking a little bit of time here. I understand. I would probably do the same. Ooh, maybe they kept a sketchy hand. Who knows? Okay, personal tutor for... The best sorcery ever printed. Uh, take things back. I'm a little scared of. Faithless. Do we want to force this Faithless looting? I kind of want to. This is a very powerful, uh, powerful spell. I might want to. 
Yeah. This smells a little bit of weakness. They, they might not have the entomb. And again, like, you know, time is all I need. If they brick here, that'd be that'd be off uh, awesome. Looting greatest sorcerer printed. Good, get out of here. Get out of here. That's that's a freaking modern card, dude. <laughs> Okay, so there's Doomsday, and I'm trying to like figure out what uh, what the path is gonna look like, but I think it is probably gonna be Unearth, Lotus Petal, Lapman, uh, Predict. And I would assume Fleet Wraith. Let's see. So we draw predict, right? And then we predict away the lab man, draw Lord's Petal and Unearth. Say go. And then the turn after we draw Street Ray. So we unearth the lab man. I guess in that case we don't need Lotus Petal, do we? Oh, we don't need it. We can we can um, put in a Force. What about this? So next turn we predict away the Lab Man, draw Force and unearth. Say go. Well, I, I, I yeah, say go. We counter whatever they do. And then the turn after we draw three raves and we unearth the lab man and then cycle immediately and draw the and win the game. Yeah, that's probably it's probably good enough. Let's try it out. So last card is street rave. Um, then unearth force maniac crit. Yeah. Dude, I'm hella nervous. I'm hella nervous. Like, I, I want this to work out, like, one time. <laughs> like, not too scared of... I don't know what... I, uh, not too scared of... Archon, I think. Ooh, no play. I like that. I like that a lot. And I guess I don't have to predict right away. I don't have to. I, I can do that at instant speed. Yeah, let's draw predict and then pass turn. See? See the patience? See the patience here? Okay, so we have... Um... So this hand represents Force of Will plus Pitch and Tomb. So I think... Wow, do we want to counter this? Uh, they didn't have a discard spell last turn, so I don't think they will have another discard spell next turn. What's happening? What is happening? Okay, Scrubland. You could counter re reanimation spell too, but they got they got like five cards in it, and I I have a gut feeling that they probably have like multiple reanimation spells. Like they didn't cast a discard spell last turn, so I think it's all gonna. The hand is probably like um, Dark Ritual and like Exhume, Reanimate, that sort of deal, you know. Um, um la, bo, ra, I can't even type. <laughs> la, bo, how do you, wait, how do, how do you spell this guy? <laughs> how do you spell, Laboratory Maniac, okay. Yeah, of course, I got like lob, okay. Laboratory 
Oh God, I already had it. Laboratory. I already hate this call so much. <laughs> I hate you. Okay. Maniac. Oops. Good. Okay. And now, force you in tomb. Okay. And my opponent will get me if they if they rip a discard spell. If they discard my unearth, I'm dead. But I think our chances of winning are higher if, if we force the entomb. Just again, like again, what I said, like they didn't discard us last turn, so they it's the chance that they have a discard spell this turn is like fairly, fairly low. Oh shit. Okay, well, I guess it doesn't matter after all. I guess it all doesn't matter. All they're gonna do is find uh like if they have a chance of the annex, I don't care. God, what is this? Oh Archon? Sure. Oh fuck, I need to discard a car. Oh god, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Voice is getting all small. What a small voice. Look at this. This, this is like at least I'm consistent. <laughs> at least we're consistent. <laughs> Not an entomb coffin perch. Holy shit! What? <laughs> Are we carrying coffin perch? Oh no! Oh no! I already kicked myself on the balls. Like you don't have to do this for me. <laughs> you don't have to do this for me. I'm a manicated for life now, dude. Can I? Yeah, where's the, the, the Manic Hater club? Can I join? How? Like, how was this card even, like, playable in any format? Literally a more consistent deck than regular Doomsday. <laughs> Uh, yeah, um, Das Oracle is banned from today's stream. I told people that Das Oracle is like way too easy. And I want to prove that you, you can also slap without Das Oracle. And look what we had. Look what we've done. 0 02, 0 02, 02, boom. Clean sign. Clean sign that this deck is like way too good without Das Oracle. Oh, nice. We got pet. Okay. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome, number. Welcome everyone, this is round number quattro, uh, round number four, in this Legacy League. Pick a path, please. Oh yeah. yeah. Round number four in this league, Doomsday without Fast Oracle, let's kick some ass. Dramatic Sphere, dude, yeah. I mean, if you go lap, man, you, you, gotta, you gotta do it right, you gotta do it right. There's like no no excuses, you know. You you gotta. It's like like Labman without Chromatic Sphere is like, I don't know, like sushi without wasabi, you know. It's it's just it doesn't work. Um. <laughs> mm, also, it's probably time to get a little bit of chocolate. Oh. I don't got dark chocolate. Mm. Why is a dark chocolate the, the worst? Oh, hey. Hi. Mm. Uh huh. Might have seen you before. Hmm. Okay, so they got a Delve of Secrets, turn one, and Double Thoughtsies. Double Thoughtsies and the <laughs> flip Delve of Secrets on turn one is pretty, pretty good. Mm -hmm. We need to hit, like, 
yeah, something but but a Delta. I almost don't want to thought these them, to be honest with you. Um you might even wanna you might hit something like a crystal brand, I don't know. Yeah, the, the more I think about it, I, th I don't think I want to thought these them. Uh, the two life is like the two life is way too precious. <laughs> we need to to add red for right of flames. <laughs> what what year is this? Two thousand eight. Imagine if a, if opponent had played extreme fast game. Yeah, dude. Then we would be victorious. Holy shit! Come on, come on, Jack. Please, no, not so many catch lands. I got already. This is too. This is simply too much. Man, how good that we don't care about menace. Also, I, I bet, I bet a thousand yen, which is about like ten bucks, that more than half of legacy people don't know how menace works. I'm pretty confident. <laughs> yeah, that archon, man. Like, if that archon didn't, what's that to? Oh yeah. Like, Fartis even doesn't hurt if your hand is all bad. So I guess the plan is like to put a bunch of bad spells in your deck. Doomsday, please. Well, not quite, not quite. Uh, oh god. Oh god. This might be one of those games. Careful study, okay. Oh, this is blue black. Interesting. Oh shit, do they play forces on top of of this nonsense? <laughs> Again, thoughts is not as not as good if 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 hands all trash. Yeah, they took the thoughtsies. I'm almost kind of happy with, with that. Okay, we need to draw a little bit of action, please. A little bit of action. We haven't drawn any action spell. Oh, my drawing, my drawing abilities are pathetic. <laughs> what am I even doing here? <laughs> okay, force in. If they play force of will, then we might as well wanna bring in our duress effects. Uh, chromatic sphere again, not needed. Cavern assault seems awful against them. Packed up negation also again, not as good um, against reanimator. Need to cut three more cards. I. I think we wanna probably shave those thoughtsies. Um, the rest is slightly better than thoughtsies. We'll probably cut a cycler. Something like this, yeah. Oh, Archon does like way, way too much. Way, way too much. Ah, uh, well, sure. Okay, it's borderline keepable. I'm gonna fire off this duress turn one. I think um, Ponda is so much better on turn two when we have a fetch. Uh, if we have a fetch and uncracked, and we can defend ourselves for days. So. Um, like reanimator, like sometimes they keep hands where like the 
or it's all dependent on their careful study. And if they have a discard spell, I, I'm probably taking that discard spell as well, because um, we want to protect our, our ponder. Okay, so what is the deal here? Animate death, dark ritual, careful study, lotus petal, thoughtsies. Oh shit, if I take lotus petal, are, aren't they dead? They are, right? Like, they have, they have zero car, uh, zero lands. If I take lotus petal, they are simply... Yeah, I'm gonna take lotus petal, easy. They have my own one. And, uh, last turn, they got... Dude, they might brick for a couple turns here. They might. Interesting keep. I mean, it, it is a turn one, uh, what is it? Uh, turn one Archon. If they thought these themselves. Okay. Sweet. <laughs> Brainstorm and Labmans. Sure. I will take the Brainstorms. I will take the Brainstorms for sure. Um, also, while opponent is uh, thinking about their no plans, hit that follow button if you haven't already down below. Oh shit, there's a patch land. Okay. And I would also like appreciate any subscriber. As we hit our 300 subscriber goal last week. No, this, was it this week? Last week. And... Um, Thoughtsies themselves, yep, yep, yep. Oh no, they, they drew reanimate in addition to animate dad. Oh, wow. Okay. Any reason for Labman list today? Just for fun, dude. Uh, yeah, because like winning with Fast Oracle is way too easy. We're going hard mode. You know, it's all about. It's all about uh, <laughs> status. It's like playing a thousand tendrils, but you know we're only allowed to to kill people with squirrels. <laughs> okay, so they got a dark ritual. Fair enough. So the last cards are animate dead and reanimate and careful study. Man, it's a crazy good hand. So. I need to. I need to brainstorm in something real powerful here. Like they can, they can play ar exactly around four plus days. Um, this brainstorm needs to deliver either like a secondary counter or a doomsday and a fast win. Like it's again, it's not Grizzly Brand. It's like only Archon of Cruelty. Ooh, okay. Well, there is a doomsday, so we don't get the kill. And I would much rather re uh, let them resolve the reanimates because they lose a bunch of life. And then we can um, discard like any nonsense spells. So one, two, three, four. I've also like don't we just win next turn? One, two, three, four, five. I think we do. With these four cards, I think we win the we win the game next turn. Um, let's go like like this. Yeah, and reanimate resolves, and we discard days to Archon. I 
think we would. Oh, I gotta, I gotta do the math properly, but. See, at least like we can we can cast doomsday and cast predict the question is do we win three four five so I cast lotus petal I cast doomsday And now I have a maniac. Um, maniac. I'm gonna. I'm gonna bottom with predict. I'm gonna unearth lotus petal and edge of autumn. Is this enough though? So if I predict now, get rid of the maniac, I draw a lotus petal and edge of autumn. Or wait, no, I draw a lotus petal and unearth. I unearth the lab man. Say go. Then they take their turn, they attack. Oh, a fudge! And oh, did they, oh, my, oh no, they make me sacrifice a creature? Oh no, oh no. I also lose, I also lose 9 life. Oh man, I can't beat. Oh god. What? <laughs> This card is so absolutely ridiculous. Why? Why are you doing this to me? I can I can put you on the battlefield already. Oh no. Thanks for your oh, oh, no. subscription. <laughs> Lab man less than 3. <laughs> Monkeys can try. Thank you so much for the for the prime sub. Holy shit, dude. This is the most ridiculous card I've played in a long while. Holy shit. Yeah, this so we can't win. We got again. <laughs> Stacks fast. Thank you so much for the follow. Appreciate it, Stacks man. Stacks fast. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, we just simply can't. We just simply can't. I mean, I'm I'm going to go through the motions just to like just to like kind of like show you what's going what will happen, right? So we go laboratory maniac. We get that fella on the battlefield. <laughs> and we simply pass her. That's like the saddest thing ever. That's like the saddest thing ever. Oh, nur weil er German steht. Danke schön. <laughs> merci, merci. I have depression. De depression. <laughs> Thank you so much. I, I don't even want to select this guy. Holy shit. Oh, man. Let me. Yeah. Finish me off, daddy. Come on. Come at me. Come at me. Did someone say. Did someone say we, we, uh, we go 0 05 in this league? Because we are super, super close. So this is the deck list we're playing today. Again, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay. Well, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna stand by my word, saying that that's Oracle way too easy. So you know, we, we're gonna go in crack mode today. If crack the chromatic sphere, unearth predicts lab man, um, and good old Emmer cool in the sideboard. And look at our record. You know, this is like the most consistent record I've ever had. I think in the last couple of streams. So. <laughs> 
<lacht> oh, Hamburg. Hey, servus. Nice. Ja, High Five nach Hamburg. Sehr, sehr geil. Should have double done double Doomsday Pulse and Time Sparrow wins. Ooh. And what's the win con? You just hope your opponent concedes or like do you time out your opponent? <laughs> How do you... Time Sparrow is, time sparrow is like a different animal. Tendrils? Okay, okay. Yeah, maybe you wanna you wanna like, shoot me like a deck list or something or like old school doomsday. Oh, was, but that's not the the list of burning wish, is it? Because that deck looked like hella fragile and complicated. Have you cast Chromatic Sphere like, even like once today? Wonder. Gerard. Cool dude. Cool dude. For anyone out there who is uh who kept attention to the to that uh like story during invasion block. It's cool. I didn't read it myself, but um I got a couple of stories. Maybe I'm wrong, but maybe this is like the wrong shell for this deck. Like all, like a lot of losses we had today were like because we, we, we were like able to get this fella on the board, but then, you know, like it it either got like removed or we didn't have that one extra turn. <laughs> Would be more successful if Doomsday Pile was like consider Archon of Cruelty reanimate card Doomsday. Holy shit! <laughs> that, that I wouldn't. That I wouldn't mind. You know what's cool about Archon is that um, you gain three life, right? So you, you first you you cut your life in like two pieces, and then you slowly start getting gaining life. I I think you gain life, right? Archon. Like now, I'm not so sure. You gain life with Karkon. I almost like never looked at the life gain part. Oops. Uh oh yeah, you do, you do. Of course, you would watch that list. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, who wouldn't? <laughs> Does Tombstay play Archon? Ooh, I don't think so. Ah. Uh. But I haven't played and Doomsday myself. So, welcome everyone. This is round number five in this special league today. Um, with no Thus Oracle Doomsday. I'm your host, Kai, and we are playing here for the trophy. Scalding Power and Fetch. Come on, give me, yeah, give me Blue Red Delver as the finisher. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, daddy. Come at me. I'm telling you, if I win a single game, oh, look what I drew. If I win a single game against this, uh, I will probably just throw up. <laughs> okay. Islands. Uh, let me. I need to pawn the first. I need to hit more lands. Oh, hey, hi. Everyone say hi to Laboratory Maniac. If you haven't already. Special, special, special guest for the show today. So may I have a little bit of applause? Yeah, you guys can't hear the applause, but uh, there's like actually like a huge crowd. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's clapping. <laughs> what a traitor. You hear me? Like a part of me wants to like go a perfect o, uh, O10 in games. Like we are at the point where opponent gut shots us. Like, <laughs> like what is going on? Like this is it's turn two and opponent gut shots us. Okay, catching this is a good draw.
Lichnet is indeed a good draw. I'm gonna get rid of this stupid lab man ASAP. And I think I also don't need... Uh, I might need Chromatic Sphere. I probably don't need um, Predict. Let's cast Chromatic Sphere right now. Let's save some mana at least. <laughs> I'm probably, probably like reading the card. Holy shit. This is so... Getting your Chromatic Sphere dazed, dude. <laughs> <laughs> is this really like... They, like, do people actually, actually care about this card? Like... I don't know, like, has my opponent even, like, read this card? Like... <laughs> is this... This is... Like, look at this super valuable daze and look at this stinky old chromatic sphere. <laughs> is this... Is this really what you want to do, opponent? Like, dazing chromatic sphere? I'm not gonna pay. I mean, it can't, so... <laughs> oh, God. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, that's a straight upgrade to Gutshot. This is roughly, roughly how my one league with normal Doomsday went. Holy shit. Was it that bad? It can't be too bad, right? Okay, nice. We drew a second personal tutor. Exactly what I was looking for. Let's, uh, let's personal tutor immediately. Get that doomsday. And I will brainstorm now. And hope to fit okay, well we don't need this we don't need you two. Um and I will probably let's see it, I will probably cast this ponder. And try to find a little more. Okay, so we can find a fool, so that's not bad. Can we can we win though next turn? So they hit us for two points, you got on to six, you got on to oh, I guess we can't force. Okay, well any water then shuffle. Okay. Don't think we can do a brainstorm pile, can we? Oh, there's another gut shot. Okay. Oh shoot. Oh, now we're dead. This is seven points. Yeah, we go down to one life. Oops. <laughs> of course you can't. You're playing lab, man. Yeah, sh sorry. Yeah, that, that was the answer. <laughs> I was looking for that answer. <laughs> okay, so dress in. Dress in. Pack navigation in. We cut. What are the obvious cuts? Personal Tutor are the obvious cuts. Um, what else is bad? I think we don't need this many cyclers. Hey Romario, how's it going? How's it going, buddy? What do you think about this? What do you think about like going hard mode? Hard mode with um, Lab Man instead of... That's real cool. <laughs> You mostly just lost to myself. This is like, oh, yeah, forgetting. Oh, uh, don't you worry. I yeah, like this whole league, I, I've, I've caught like the past five rounds. I for, I forgot to put that Oracle in the pile. So you're not alone. This is a, this is a primo keep. Someone dooms with base days like days back up. I take it. You're not wrong? Of course I'm not wrong. <laughs> okay, so... Let's say Cabin of Souls in... Lab Man in... Um, I need I need a lot of mana, so why don't we put in... Misty Rainforest... Snow Covered Island... Traumatic... Sphere? 
question mark. One, two, three. One, two, three. I guess we cannot. We can't. We don't need to the Misty Rain Forest. We can make this like another land. Oh no, no, hold on. We can make this a uh, Lotus Petal instead. What about this? Chroma uh, Count of Souls, Chromatic Sphere, Lab Man, Lotus Petal, Underground Sea. This looks, this looks crisp. By crisp, I mean like not crisp at all, but um, we dodge removal and we dodge um, counters. That's as good as it gets. So why don't we? How do we order this? Um, I think Labman has to be last. And we want to drop Chromatic Sphere probably like next turn or so. Let's wait, now let's make Lotus Petal the last card. Maybe then safer this way. Yeah, let's do something like this. Be careful, you might daze your sphere. Like if they daze my sphere, I it's also fine. Like we have a street rave, so we can we can always like street rave and risk um with lab man on, on stack and you know go from there. Channeler, okay. Not too scary for now. Um I'm gonna play out this sphere regardless. Okay. We're going to uh, to play lab man. Maybe you can squeeze uh, three wishes or active inputs. Man, like someone old, someone uh, mentioned three wishes already, like before, like before we even like started this league. By the way, I, I finished a couple of like cool alterations today, um, like proxies for like balance. I'm gonna tweet about them later. Um, they're currently super, uh, being like enjoying those um, um, Japanese food style like ink alterations. It's pretty cool. Um, let's pass. No need to go crazy. I think I'm gonna like end of turn brainstorm um, to speed up the clock a little bit. Like what my opponent doesn't know is that we have a cavern of souls in this in, in this in the pile. I was like, opponent doesn't know that we freaking play lab man. <laughs> um, could we wish this allow to pay for LED with lab man? Okay. Storm. This is a good Power Blast target. If they have Power Blast, I would highly re highly recommend Power Blasting this Brainstorm. This is the recommendation of today. Death. Oh wow, okay. Well then. I could technically cycle now. Do I have to? No, I don't. I don't think I have to. No, I don't have to. Okay, let's do. Let's do this like one time. If this lotus petal resolves, then we win. Okay. So, are you ready, guys? This is no. I. I like. This is a little like against my rules of like winning, but I think we got this game. Okay, so we cycle now. Go down to six life, and watch. Okay, and now, oh god, I got, I gotta make like a screenshot of this. Cause this wins a hundred percent against Delver. Wait, actually, no, 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 it's not what I, it's not what I wanted to do. I think I also gonna like, so that I got some zero cards in my library. Yeah. Something like that. Cool. So, 
we go we say we, we go human i don't think i've ever said cabin of souls and human ever and cast laboratory maniac for can't be counted okay and now watch this What color do we want to add, everyone? Green, red, black, blue, or white? <sighs> Any color is fine. Green. Okay, we go with green. Green, green, green. White, of course. Like, white. <laughs> Boom! Snapshot here. <laughs> Game has ended. Game has ended. Not... Oh man, this felt so good. Ich glaube, ich kenne dich aus dem Hadria Store. Vielleicht, ja, vielleicht haben wir uns schon mal getroffen. <lacht> vielleicht, ich gehe da ab und zu mal hin zum Legacy Vintage spielen, ja. Yeah. Easy, easy. Ich wohne auch nur eine halbe Stunde von dem Store entfernt. More is my prediction of one. Dude, I, I, man, that's like so against the rules from, of today. Like, I thought you wanted to go undefeated now. <laughs> Shit, this was good. Okay, so the winning race CP with um, Laboratory Manic is you have to. You need a turn one. You need to have a turn one Doomsday, and your opponent has to break a couple turns. What is happening? What is happening? What in the world is happening? Dragon Ray Chandler, there you go. Du meinst, sie hätte voll den deutschen Akzent? Uh, alle Deutschen haben den deutschen Akzent. Ah, die meisten Deutschen, die ich kenne. Ah, Ach, Strand, Strand. Yeah, ah, uh, actually, no. No, no, no. You could have caused Dark, Dark Witch with Cavern and Sphere, dude. I saw that. Uh, it, it is. Believe me, that's. It's not pretty. It's not pretty. <laughs> uh. oh, okay, cool. This Nimble Mongo van. Cool, cool. Man, imagine if this was Nimble Mongoose. Like, you would live in a happier place. Okay, at least Ragavan's gonna eat one of those cards. Um, it's good. I want him to eat. Um, Force of Will here. Yeah, don't need Force of Will. Ire, wie spricht denn Ire? Okay. Yeah. Like that force daddy uh-huh like i'm bad it's a way of like doing anything by the way but you know it's not over it's not over little surprise how um how slowly dragon rage channel uh, like charges up to like a uh, three three mm. Excuse him, what? Start, okay. What do you mean in general in this particular game? Did I say something weird? Hope not. Hope not. 
also like probably like my opponent's probably thinking like you know <laughs> how do i ever beat lab man off cavern of souls with chromatic sphere on, on the field like they they might actually be thinking like hey dude like this is like this new this new kid kid on the block you know at least uh no dude just just getting smashed <laughs> it's, it's all what i gotta do for you for today oh wasteland how lovely obviously like it's not like we are beating this hand by the way like they're, they're gonna play Merc's hand next turn and like I mean we are we are uh, almost 100% dead here yep 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 do your thing Earth of situation They got five power on board. We go down to ten life. They play a Merc, so they have us on a one-turn clock. Um, so I need to hit a brainstorm into pretty much the nuts. Okay, the hit possible. Good. That's a good start. Oh, in general about this particular game oh I, I feel like i i don't know like lately like dragon rage shallow does a, a lot of like crazy um filtering right like i see this card more as a like a as a sensei's divining top ish card than a delver card if you know what i mean like uh... oh they still have days in their hands too yeah, yeah. okay Fair enough, fair enough. I didn't want to, to spoil the fun here, but we trophied. <laughs> but look at this. This like it doesn't get more consistent than that. <laughs> this is a clean 05. <laughs> This is this is the cleanest finish I have done. This is like the cleanest finish I've done in a while, dudes. Like, this is <laughs> have we? So how often did we actually have Lapman on the battlefield? I feel like we had it on the battlefield twice, three times. Yeah, and we got freaking murdered today for today like it's not it's not as if like if i was like expecting too much but that's gonna be it for today thank you so much everyone for tuning in if you enjoyed everything you saw um you know just click that follow button click that subscribe button i would appreciate every single one of you also if you want to get your cults altered um you know oh uh, homepage is right there sartarix.com it's literally my name.com so um, I'm open for any kind of alterations. I'm posting like regularly on, on Twitter on, on my discord Everyone can join the discord for free. I also added a, a sell and trade Channel to my discord so people can like sell and trade the cards if they want to if they feel like it and Jump in it's for free, you know, uh, you got nothing to lose you can also like jump out if, if you don't like it You know, it's completely up to you um, But thank you so much everyone for, for sticking to the stream and uh to to my content and everything yeah it's, it's kind of like i mean you know like going oh four oh five is honestly i'm happy that i went oh five and not some like random like two three because two three just doesn't like this is a message oh five is a message oh five is the message we're gonna send out to everyone out there who believes that that's oracle was not the reason why doomsday got like became tier one okay this is like this is like a fact so we're gonna stick to that let me see if I can uh, raid someone. Any any other like weirdos out there? We got a new follower. I guess. Underscore. 
Yeah, why don't we why don't we um raid yellow hat? So meanwhile, yeah, take it sleazy and I will see you hopefully soon enough, uh, soon again. Uh, and hopefully with a, de a better deck like this, so keep it sleazy. Sawatarix.com. The new homepage is up. It's the place where you can submit your personal MTG alteration requests. You can also check out my art. I usually do acrylic paintings. I stream magic about like 2-3 times per week. And if you want me to play your deck on my stream, then uh, let's fucking go. And have I even mentioned that I do coaching too? Well, there's like so much more to it, so please check out my brand new homepage, swatarix.com. Thank you so much, boy.